All right, how are we doing? I'm Colin and this is Shine Automotive. And that, that is our XRTT. And we are racing right now. And there is no time for us to do a video on that. But we've got to get this ready to go racing. If you don't like this video, I'm sorry. Tough titties. We're just doing you a filling video for the weekend. So let's tell you what we're gonna do. So our gearbox from the last race decided to wheat oil everywhere. Now I've not had time to get that to the shop to get repaired over in Leeds. So we've just put the same coded gearbox in and that's that. We've got an eight hour race coming up at Brands Hatch, which we'll be racing right now as this video is going up. The video will be near, the race will be nearly finished, I reckon. So what we've got to do is we've got to chuck a load of these bits on. Now our friends at Bill Stein have jumped on board with the channel and they sent us everything out that we need for the job. As you've seen, we had some brand new arms, but they went on the Turbo K in a previous video. There's a link up above now to that. Because our arms, we run a polybush back kit that goes in there and there. You polyurethane bush and you get them from Burton Power because they supply mandatory bits for the championship. Also, Burton Power supply the Mintex Racing Enduro K pad and can you see the markings there? I'll get one out the carrier. So they're all marked up for the K. You cannot get these anywhere else apart from Burton Power. They're an expensive pad, but we nearly... Do we get a full season out of a pad nearly, don't we, Nathan? Look, Nathan's come to help because it's a race car. What does Nathan do that old subscribers might know? Give him a call give us a little wave. Oh, so we've got them pads there. So we're chucking them pads on. Nathan had requested that we put new shoes on the back because the ratchets were starting to go. And I think this is what helped makes the pedal travel quite far down. Some spark plugs. We prefer to run the Denzel spark plugs, but in the championship, you've got the choice of running MGK, Bosch or Denzel. And in the rules and regs, it tells you what part numbers of what you can use. MPD, now I'll put a little clip up now. <laughs> what have you got for us? Oh, look at these. Are these for the race car? They certainly are, mate. Thank you very much. MPD sponsors on this race car and the YouTube channel, and they're fantastic. There's a link down below to their website where you can get all your parts at reasonable prices. Isn't that right? Certainly is. So thanks MPD for sorting us these out. I need a beautiful assistant. Oh, I need just a beautiful assistant. That'll be me. Oh, is it? Did you go to the club on Friday? Was it very busy? Oh, I've got some proof of that. Let's show them what happened. Fucking <laughs> empty! Got a knife. Are you alright? He's Bob and Beck have been sent out by MPD. The recorded disc, now we go through this quite a lot. So Bob and Beck, Mintex, anything like that, he's, he's fine really. I wouldn't use Drive Master, would you? And do you know what? I probably I would use Drive Master, in all fairness, because I've never had any issues. Bob and Beck, I think they do a lot of clutches that are standard in the Land Rover range, aren't they, Nathan? If uh, I'm correct. Yeah. 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 I don't know. I'm just saying yes. I think they are. I think they are. I think Sam's mentioned it before. So they're the discs that we're going to chuck on the front with them new pads. So there should be no no issues with stopping. Take it easy for the next 400 miles. <laughs> yeah, really? Set of drop links from Febby. So we've got a set of drop links, new drop links to go on there. Ba -ba -ba -da -ba. Oh, Dad, why are you on with the inside TT? People want to see that. There's my ball. Turn my ball, Dad. Turn the ball. Set of rear wheel bearings. But we won't be fitting the, the inserts, we will just be putting the bearing brace in. There's a reason for that, um, and it took us a while to work out why we don't replace that. There we go, might be to save with the bearings not failing. But the bearings are getting changed because we've done four races on the rear wheel bearings, and with Febby kindly sent us out some rear new bearings, we'll swap these out, get them greased up, ready to go. In here, we have a set of steering arms. You look really happy to be here, Nathan. It's been a long time since you and me have done a K video. Yeah, yeah. It's nice to see that everyone else from the team's turned up to work. Can I, can I have a feel of your shaft? Of course. Thank you. Oh, look at that. You've got a greasy tip as well. So we're gonna put new steering arms in. I don't think you can, you can't get better than February really, can you? No, 
Not at all. That's very good, Fabi. Right, and Fabi have sent out some tracker then, so we'll get them on. We have had want with Wayne. We've had. Did it snap off there or was it off the ball? It, it was off the. I think it was off the top with the loading yeah. round. Alton Park, we had a bit of a mishap, so we like to change the track ends quite a lot, but we're gonna put some new steering arms. So a pair of them to fit. I've got some new oil to go in, a new oil filter, but they're in the back of Sam's van and he's not here. So I'll just stick it on a time lapse. Yes, you've got a video this weekend. So then next Wednesday, there won't be a video and next weekend, I'll definitely have something else done on that beautiful fine machine. You what? Found a nut. You're missing a nut. So yeah, thanks to everyone that's uh, sponsored and supplied these bits. Massive thank you to Burton Power, MPD and Febby. Thank you very much. The garage looks a mess. Would you believe half of this stuff is out of customers' cars when we're working on? Look at that big stack of stuff there. Waffle, waffle, waffle. Do you fancy a brew, Nate? Before we start? Brew. We've got some good mugs down in the merch, uh, merch, merch store down below, so go check them out. Thanks. I've got my racing diet and prep for racing. I absolutely totally forgot about this as well. So, when we did the Turbo K video, I needed a radiator, so hang on. Nathan! Sorry. That is probably the, one of the nicest cars I've seen for a long time. That's a proper genuine. And do you know what? That was cheaper than the last radiator. It was just cheap radiator. Look at that. that I'm quite impressed with that quality of life. It's originally original, isn't it? So yeah, that's the radiator to go in there. So hopefully we'll have coolant in the truck. Hopefully. That smells, that smells so bad. That, have you smelt it yet? <laughs> but don't be giving me a call this week we will race. Right, today's turning into a nightmare. The fan, ah, I'm being trapped. Ugh. It's been like one of them Sundays. Right, the radiator housing was all cracked and I've looked everywhere in all my spares and I do not have a spare. So I'm having to use some of that big boy fiberglass bonding stuff that I'm gonna use on the XRT team on the weekend. Yeah, it'll be on the weekend from this video going out. That's all right. I'm just gonna let it go off, tidy it with its soft pad and put some more on because it's just broke that corner out, which um, is not ideal just before we go racing, but I don't have another one and I ain't got time because this car needs to be loaded up today because I just don't have any time this week and we're leaving Friday morning, possibly Thursday night now, but we'll see. Nathan's we've got all his side broke back up, new discs, new pads, steering arm and tracker end, they're all on. We're jumping onto the other side. This will be dry and then I can get the radiator in and then we can get it trapped up. Oh, you've put the shafts in as well. Hey! You're on a time lapse here, Nathan, and you've got to make sure your work is second to none. I don't want us being noted as a bad garage or something. Do you know what I mean? We don't know what we're doing. Well, we don't. Oh. Well, we can pretend we know what we're doing. I, I know to make pork pies. Does that qualify me? 
Ja, det kunne det blive, ja. Ja, og det er med. Right, that's all the front sorted. All we've got to do now is get it tracked up. I've took the radiator in, which in all fairness, I've spent all this time working on the radiator and Nathan's built all the front end up. So what we'll do is we'll, we, I keep saying wait, it's a royal way. Nathan will jump on and they'll start stripping the back end down and putting new shoes and new bearings in the back. So we'll stick it on the town and get it back on with the rear end now. Enjoying it today, what? You feeling rough? I feel like I've had 15 pints. What do you reckon to XRT? And what do you reckon to this silk? Oh, I'll paste in now. Looks very nice. Get some of that doggy in there. Yes. I got that big boy body filler that sent it all out, so. There's some there, I've actually used it today. Oh, it is a big boy. Yeah, it's big boy, big boy body filler. Looks like Eddie. Let's have a look. Oh, it is Eddie. It is Eddie. If you know who Eddie is, Eddie. Oh, yeah, Eddie is hard. Lovely. You look like Madonna. Don't I? Yeah. You not remember? Oh, I'm going far away, really, right? Like. like a virgin touched for the very first time. Like a virgin. How's your drums? Yeah. The greasy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Right, you're building this side up first. Or have you got tools on that side? On this side. Alright. Hey? Let's get the tools now at this side. Hey, you are a tool. You're doing a good job down there. Yeah. Can you get a <laughs> You've only got a bolt to do on this side to tighten up. I don't even think it's worthwhile putting it on a time lap just to put two nuts on. It's not. No, it's not. It's not. It's just it's tracking yeah, slow mo. <laughs> Dad, show up. Get this car back together. I want to go home. High five. Oh, Dad. Careful, careful. You had me nutcrackers then, man. So this year we've gone with just putting the fog lights in for the nighttime race because I'll put a bit of footage up now can you see what we had it lit up like last year. Excuse me, what's going on? Oh, is this Disco Dave? Disco Dave in the rave. So yeah, we're just gonna test them. The lights that we had up in the wheel latches are still there and the ones down the sills. So we're gonna try and find the supply for them now, get them put in. We were gonna put the oil in, but there's a little bit of an issue with the oil. I haven't got an oil filter and the oil filter's in the back of Sam's van. I have tried ringing it, but I can't get out of him. He's probably like sod rip talking to Colin on a, uh, on a Sunday. Yeah, totally. I need to lose some beef. I don't like my big chin. Don't you laugh at me? That's all I like. Talk to me mother like this and like, this is how the women catfish you, don't they? Like, and then they take all these nice videos and they stick the neck out and they're like, 
Oh, look nice. I mean, really, when you meet them in person, they're like, blah, 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 blah. I thought some rubbish done that. Uh, no wonder why people don't like this channel. Stop talking and just get on with what you're doing. Right, right. If you don't like it, you know what to do. Everyone else does. My, by this time, we might have 10,000 subscribers. You lot are amazing. I don't need to keep saying it, but you lot are amazing. And if you're new to the channel, welcome. If you're old to the channel, welcome back. To all the top people that always drop a comment in on the comment section, all the good lads and that. All well, the lads and lasses, we have a Patreon account. Pound a month, help us make more content for you. I'm trying now to do two videos a week to get the channel growing, but who knows? Right, we'll get some power supplied. Stick it, stick it, stick it back on a time lapse and we'll get all these lights sorted out and then hopefully we can show you a bit of the old disco day. So me and Nathan have got pretty much smashed on today. We've just been and watched the F1 and we've come back in here and got the lights finished. So we'll just show you the lights. This is the setup. We won't be going any more fancier because it's just, we haven't got the time and I just want to make it easier just to swap from the nighttime race to the uh, setup. We have got a 24 hour race next year. So I don't want it drawing loads of ampage off the, the alternator. Alternator, because you know what these alternators are like. So if Nathan kindly sticks the lights on and I'll turn these lights off. We're not too Disco Davy, but you know, we've got the shine theme going on. What, what do you reckon, Ellie? Oh, look at the glow. Right, so we've got, so under the wheel arches, we've got this bit of glow, and then we've got these LEDs that run down. Same as we've got the underglow with the green on there. And then we've got these bright boys, proper bright, set on a nice cross pattern. That's what. The southern map man says anyway, blah you, blah you, wee me. So there we go. So what we'll do is tomorrow night, well, like bright, that's proper bright. What we'll do is tomorrow night is we'll get the wheels on. Well, in the morning, I'm going to put the oil on, oil on, the oil in, the new oil filter. Then we'll get it outside for the day. Then we'll bring it back in tomorrow night. We'll do the tracking, get it aligned up. Then the following day, I'll get it all washed down, cleaned up and get it polished. I'm going to polish it and wax it. So it'll cut through the air like lightning. And then hopefully we'll have some luck. This is our end of our third year of doing this uh, series. I wish it was a championship, but there we go. Because I, I like championships. I really, really like championships. And I just would love to be on the podium. We've been so close a few times and we've had some silly mistakes and little bits that have let us down. But there we go. We are sorted. Did you put the fab light on? I That's all right. I was just checking. I was worried then. So we've got a rain light. We might have to fix the rain light again because that's lost a couple of, couple of LEDs, but I don't know what the percentage is. So yeah, right, we'll see you uh, when it's time to track it up. See you later, Nev. Bye. Bye, he's waving. Uh, we'll, we'll stop that. I'm going to get inside and we're going to bleed the brakes and the clutch. That would help out for me in the morning to get it moved. What do you say, Lee? Yeah, Dad, hurry up because I really just want to go to bed. Or do you want the ball? Or no biscuit? Are you dindins? You found the screw that you were missing? Yeah. Thanks. What do you reckon to XRTT coming on? Mean, innit? Yeah. It looks like it's been in a bump. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they're nice. They're nice. I wonder where you can get them from. Link down below. And the pennies with free post. 3 99 Both sides with a detailing on that. What a day it has been. I'm just outside finishing my day's graph. Roland's just come down, so Roland's gonna jump on me getting the bits ready. The bits ready, I don't know if he knows what he's doing. I don't think he's a competent driver. Do you know what he's doing, Roland? Eh? Huh? Oh, he's, he's about got it. It's level enough, straight enough, mate. Just, uh, oh, we're tracking it up, so you need to get it quite good, in all fairness. So just go, you want to be over that side a bit. So, Na uh, not Nathan, Nathan's on his way. So, Roland's going to now, he's going to 
get all the plugs back on in the crit firing order. He's going to put an oil filter on it, and he's going to then put a um, put the oil in it. So I'll stick it on a time lapse because I'm just outside finishing my Dave craft, and um, Roland Roland knows what he's doing. He works on bikes for a living, but I'm sure he can put an oil filter on a K and get the crit firing order of the plugs on the back of the frames. Yeah. And then on the back of the axle, on the, the bush pack. Got a jack of K up on the sills, if you know that, you know that, don't you? Crusty! Now it's Wednesday night now and we're just sorting all the spares. Nathan's just been and I forgot to bloody film it because Nathan sorted all the spares out to run all the lockers. Jake's just going through all the stuff, the gazebo, getting the um, getting the jacks in the back. If you've never seen these set truck build before, I'll put a link up above now. We've got a full build series that we've been doing our race transport. So we've got our lockers, all the spares and that under there. The living's in there, very nice. And I'm just, there's the fuel jugs, just getting everything ready to go, turn that stereo off. I'm doing that Corsa van. You see we were messing about the other day, I've been doing some work on that, took that stupid roof rack off. Jake's redone the pinstripe round the bottom, because that had all come off, and just touched in a bit of the paintwork. Just, oh, he hasn't, he hasn't touched in that bit yet, but I'm going to touch that bit in. Now, all right, Bella, it's a late one tonight, mate, you might as well get tucked up in your bed here. We had a little bit of rubbings racing at the front here, so I've redone the white tonight, right down there, and then we'll just put a pinstripe on. It was very bodgy. I just held a bit of cardboard, cardboard, a cardboard up as I went along. So in 20 minutes or something, Jake will put a pinstripe on there. It just gives it some definition. He's going to put the number plates on, the championship number plates that we've got to put on. You haven't forgot about that, have you? Oh, you've got them? I, I'll, I'll shut up. One of the holes isn't very good, mate, so just go steady, duck. Wang it up too much with the gun. Then we've got to put the coolant in. The battery's back on, now I have to tape all the terminals up, obviously for obvious reasons. Coolant's to go in and we'll run it up. But give it about 20 minutes. Oh, no. How have I done that? I've got paint on my hand somewhere. I hope I haven't, bloody. Oh, no. Have I touched? I don't think I've touched the other. I don't know, but I've put a run in it here. Let's... Let's flicker in, let's flicker in. Just, you'll have to let this dry for a little bit. Uh, this is, this is proper F1 race car prep. 
There you go, it's like brand new. That'll do. Tomorrow, what's that? Dog hair. Ooh, dog hair, Billy's. Tomorrow, it'll be the dog hair is still there. Tomorrow, we'll be pulling it outside, getting it all washed down, get it polished, load it up, and then we're good to go racing. I used to do the racing videos, but they don't go down very well. I think people don't. It's a bit boring, really, watching GoPro stuff and me. It's going around the track, going round and round and round. I think you enjoy the prep side more than anything else. So yeah, right, how are we getting on? Good, right, yeah, I'll, um, don't know, we'll check back when we've got it back on the ramp. I'll touch that bit of scuffing on that back bumper now, you can't see it. That one there, I'll do that now, very, very nice. Right, so we're bringing it over to temperature now, and we're bleeding out, yeah. Getting a new radiator, making sure we haven't got any leaks, making sure it's all good for race day. Right, it's Thursday night, it's pitch black. Right, it is proper late now. We're leaving in the morning. We've got the car to wash down and then that's getting loaded in. Jake's there doing them wheels. You can't really see a lot. There's tech products. Got the underglow lights on, ready for the couple of hours that we do in the dark. Got that corner done. We have a look. Got that corner done and then pinstriping all on there. Cling Spore, Legends. Tech Products, Cling Spore, John. Motorpass Direct, Cambridge Hawk. Chris Pryor Graphics, Shine Automotive. Who else is on here? RS Pro finishing the wheels. AJS Auto Tech, Wait for Wayne, Orange Army, because you lot are legends. So yeah, the car is a wash away from being ready. So next weekend, hopefully we'll have an XRTT video. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy this one because this is I've squeezed this in and now I'm going to edit this before we load. So I'll probably be editing it till two, three o'clock in the morning. Head down, then get in the wagon, drive down to Bronze Hatch in the morning. It's nuts, but I want to make videos for you and I want the channel to boom. So thanks for watching. Love you all. See you in the next one. Bye.